So here we have the 2020 Burton Process. And this is an all mountain freestyle board. It's full twin, so perfect for riding switch, getting some tricks in the park, um, really fun little profile to ride. Um, it's a medium flex, uh, probably like a four or five on a scale. Um, just medium, really fun. It'll still hold in the carve quite nicely, be stable at speed, um, but you'll still be able to get a nice press out of there, um, a little bit more forgiving as well. And um, this comes in two types of cambers. Um, we have a pure pop camber version and a flying V version. Um, and the base is Burton Sintered base. It's um, highly durable, soaks in loads of wax, so you don't need to wax it all the time, um, and really fast on them uh, flat pieces. It features the Superfly 2 core. Uh, they use stronger and lighter woods in targeted areas of the board. Uh, it'll provide more pop and strength, and it will also reduce the weight of the board. Features squeeze box. This is where the board's core is profiled. Uh, it thickens and thins throughout in certain areas. So underneath the feet of the board, um, the core is thinner, meaning it's more flexible. So you can get more torsional flex out of the board, um, a little bit easier to control. Um, and the, on the outside of your feet, the board is thicker, meaning it's a bit stiffer. Uh, you can transfer the energy of the board across to your tip and tail. Um, so that's a more responsive part of the board. Features frostbite edges. This is where um, the edge will come out by an extra 10 millimeters underneath your feet, um, meaning that you'll get more hold in hard pack and in icy conditions, you'll find that you won't slip out as much. The laminate of the board is a triax fiberglass. Um, this is for a more versatile flex and response. So if you're just cruising down the hill or charging the mountain, um, it's a really good all round fiberglass. So the process, I would recommend this for all abilities. This is a really great value board. You get a lot of tech for the money you're putting into it. Um, if you're a beginner, just wanting a nice board that's gonna make you progress, it's a great board for you. Um, you have the two versions of camber. If you want something a little bit more um, park friendly, um, a little bit more poppy and aggressive in the carve, um, I would probably recommend going with the pure pop version. Um, if you want something a lot more forgiving, so this is more aimed at your beginner, kind of like more progressive rider, um, I would definitely recommend the Flying V version. Flying V is just a very simple, easy profile to ride, and will build your confidence right up and will float really nicely in the powder. Um, this, um, this board I probably wouldn't recommend as your all round free ride board, um, but pretty much all mountain. If you want to pop off piece, that's great. Get in the park, even better. Um, but yeah, a real great board for the whole hill. Um, and that is the process uh, for 2020 from Burton.